Zulu Wedding is a much anticipated romantic comedy movie from producer and director Dineo Sekelwane. It's the first for South Africa to have a black female producer and director who also created the concept of the film. Unashamedly romantic, glamorous and absolutely hilarious all at the same time, the film pays a loving tribute to the richness of African culture. And we're joined by Dineo Sekelwane to share more on the film and production. Dineo, very good morning. Welcome. Thank you so much. Thank you for so having me. So good to see you. Thank you. Great stuff. And uh, the movie was released yesterday and judging from the attendance, how was it received really? I wasn't watching. I was actually outside the whole time. <laughs> but I heard really great things. Um, so we've had great reports. People had a great time. Uh -huh. But you know, sometimes you think they're being polite. So <laughs> when they see you, they have to be nice to you. Yeah. But apparently there was laughing and clapping. So that's, that sounds like a, a good night out. Yeah. And uh, did you not understand that the plan was to release the movie simultaneously throughout Africa with uh, VIP screenings yes. all over the place? Yes. Is that how it will be uh, happening? No, because, because of the xenophobic attacks, uh, we had to change some of our plans. I see. So other African countries are moved out to later. Mm -hmm. But I mean, uh, Southern Africa is releasing one night, in, in the same night last night. Okay. And it, it went quite well. So we're doing a few um, screenings as we're going. Yeah. And uh, we, we hope it's going to be very successful. And uh, what's particularly even more fascinating about this film is that it was produced by a black female producer okay. and director. Uh, take us through some of the challenges that you encountered uh, as a black female in this very uh, hard-hitting industry. Well, I think black female, money. <laughs> but also just, uh, I was very lucky in terms of the cast and the crew. Mm. They were really great people. Okay. And I think that's where we generally get disrespected. But my crew was amazing and my cast was amazing. Mm. But I think the biggest challenge was just raising the money. Okay. And just, you know, now the, the new challenge is trying to make sure that as many people watch it. Because okay. a lot of our films, which are really great, get released and no one ever gets to see them. So now it's time to figure out how to do this right. How do you get it out into the market? And, and I wonder why it was so difficult raising money because this is such a beautiful concept. I mean, on paper, it looks absolutely astounding. Well, I think, you know, South Africa have, you know, have a... I mean, the, the, the communities that have money mm -hmm. um, outside of the government, you know, they haven't really invested in film. And it's understandable because black films have not made money. Mm -hmm. So obviously, um, corporates are very nervous to get in. But, you know, once people saw some of what we shot in 2016, it made it a bit easier to then um, get the money together. But, you know, okay. money is an issue for every filmmaker in the world. It's right, not just right. us. But uh, here we're just trying to get corporates more involved and have them fund a film. But films have to make money for sure. people to want to fund them. You know, all we have to do right now is to simply to get up and go watch that movie. So uh, without giving too much away, do you want to mm -hmm. give us a sneak preview into what, to, uh, what this movie is all about? Well, it's about a, a lady called Lungile who's originally from KZN. Yeah. Um, she had lived in Joburg for a long time with her parents. And then she moves to New York to pursue a dance career and to mm -hmm. get away from this debt that her parents left her with. She falls in love. Uh, her husband wants, well, her fiancé wants to do a lobola in South Africa. He's an American. And then when she comes here, she has to face all the things that she had run away from. Mm -hmm. And uh, she meets the young Zulu man, falls in love with him as well and has to choose between the two men. So that's, that's really it in a nutshell. Yeah. And uh, from the trailer, I can pick the, the star-studded cast, including uh, we have uh, Palis Landla there, we have uh, Kelly Kumalo and, uh, and international actor yeah. D Darren David Henson. Mm -hmm. How did you get this particular actor to be part of the cast? I just asked, <laughs> you know. Really? I did that just thing. You know that. how Americans will ask you, do you know some source or ever from Zambia? Mm -hmm. I was at a party in L.A. and then asked the person next to me, hey, do you know Lem? And she was like, no, but my friend does. Okay. And then the friend arrived. I'm like, hey, do you know Lem? They gave me Lem. Because he played a character called Lem in Soul Food many years ago when I, I was see. much younger. Okay. And they called him. And I called him. I was like, hey, do you want to come to South Africa? Jeez, man, and just like, like that? yes. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Well done. Well so, done. Yeah, yeah. So where can we see this film? Everywhere. Everywhere. It is opening in 56 cinemas um, throughout Southern Africa. And, um, you know, you can just check out hashtag Zulu Wedding Movie, okay. go to our website. We have a whole cinema list, but it's basically everywhere. I mean, we were quite um, lucky to get so many sites. Um, I mean, Homoto this evening is um, hosting a screening in PE. Okay. So it's, it's everywhere. everywhere What's you that can website again? Pardon me? What's that website again? It is uh, ZuluWeddingMovie.com. .com, okay. Yes.
All right, Janelle, all the best, man. Congratulations, Thank eh? You. Thank you. Thanks I for chatting it. to us. Thank you. Well, feisty choreographer Lungile will do a lot to avoid falling in love and even more to avoid going home to South Africa where she's traditionally engaged to a king. Well, that's the movie Zulu Wedding. We just spoke to the producer and the director, Dino Sekelwane, on the film. This is Morning Life. Let's take a quick break. We'll be right back.